world. Terka Lumeres. No one knows how far its lands and oceans stretch. For the people are no match against the hordes of monsters that crawl the earth. Barriers protect the cities in which we live, and we are completely dependent upon them for our survival. These barriers are generated by the Blastia. Blastia use the primeval power of air that fills the world to provide us with fire, water, and light. They provide us with everything that has made the Empire prosper. Forget the threat of the vicious monsters lying in wait, just beyond the barriers. The blessings of the Blastia will bestow ever more prosperity to the world and peace to its people. I don't get it. What could have happened to the barrier in this town? From the Imperial capital, Zophius, bedrock of peace, we pray, may tranquility bless this world. What's with all the yelling, Ted? Look! The Aqua Blasty is broken again! And they just finished fixing it! What's the big deal? Just leave it to the mighty Imperial Knights. That's what they're there for. Huh, the Knights? You know they never come to the lower quarter. What about the heroic Flynn? I already tried to get Flynn. They wouldn't even let me see him! Huh. So I'm Flynn's replacement, huh? Never mind that. Come on! We're short on people! Ted! Ted! You get down here! They need your help, too! Oh, I'll, I'll be there in a sec! Yuri, come on already! That's weird. He always comes running whenever there's trouble. This place is gonna become an aquarium soon if this keeps up. First, the trouble with the knights yesterday. Now the Aquablastia breaks. Why does stuff like this happen every day in the lower quarter? <coughs> I know, I know. There's no use whining about it. <coughs> Who got 
just seen it all somehow. What's going on? Are we sucking treasure down there? Yeah, but you're late, so I'm not sharing. <laughs> How nice. Hey, it's sink or swim in this world. Looks like that blue-blooded mage we hired to fix the blast deal left the job half done. Glad you can find the time to stop by, Yuri! Take it easy with the water sports, old man. You're not getting any younger. You're up next! Not afraid of a little water, I hope. Yikes. Come on now, put your backs into it! Hey! Oh! Hey! Ace is really going at it. He feels responsible. He's the one who pushed the people to get the money together for the repairs. And now he's the one who's all wet. It's not Hanks' fault that mage did a two-bed repair job, though. That's true. He even parted with his wife's keepsake to help raise the money. in the center. Huh? Is it gone? Yeah, the Blastia won't work with the core missing. That aristocrat who came to do the repairs was the last person to touch the Blastia, right? That's right, a Mr. Mordial. And he lives in the Royal Quarter? Yeah, so? Forget about that, Yuri. Give us a hand here. Sorry, Hanks. I just remembered an errand I've got to run. Hey, wait just a minute! You're not seriously thinking of going to Mr. Mario's place, are you? The Royal Quarter? Me? I wouldn't be caught dead going to a place like that. It gives me the creeps. Damn it, Yuri! Just because you can do a few tricks with that bony blast here, you think you're invincible. Here's hoping he doesn't do anything crazy. He always seems to cause problems when the lower quarter's involved. Even the Knights have started keeping an eye on him. Well, it's just an average day for Yuri. I'm sure he'll be fine.
Looks like the nobles are living the sweet life as usual. The lower quarter's right there. They still don't give a damn. It's not their loss, so what do they care? They should act, you know, noble. Not just dress nice and hide in their mansions. So it is you who are the cause of all this commotion. I know he's poor, but breaking into an aristocrat's house? My, my, how the mighty have fallen. Just what I needed. Tweedle A and Tweedle B. Just I what say, is a Tweedle anyway? There's no hope of escape. We've got you surrounded. Does it look like I'm trying to escape? See, it's stuff like that that keeps you guys from getting promoted. You did not just say that! I say, you take that back! Enough beating around the bush, I guess. Stand back, Otacor! I'll handle this, in the name of the Imperial Knights! I say, I shall be the one to defend the good name of the Imperial Knights. Peons, I say, should stand back! You're the peon! No, no, I say, I am your superior! I appreciate the sentiment, guys, but let's cut the cat fight and get on with it. Hey, let's go. You ready? I am your superior! Nay, Focus. You are, I say, clearly my subordinate. I guess I just gotta whack these guys a little. Okay. 
can't see a thing. Ow! There, how'd that make you feel? How dare you! Hitting someone in the middle of an argument is hardly proper manners. Didn't you hear me when I said, you ready? Or were you not listening? Damn it! Oh, oh brother. Ah, uh, you! Stop right there! Does it look like I'm running? You! Be quiet! Oops, time for a little defense. Blocked my attack! I say Sonic Thrust! Whoa, come on, give me a break. Ooh! I say, how dare you block my art! Man, you need to calm down. If you can use strike arts here, then I can too. Azure! Azure! Let's try that again. This next one's gonna hurt. Ah, oh, you're not giving up already, are you? Ah, uh, I say, Imperial Knights never give up! You have yet to see our true power! This next time's for real, guys. That's my line, I say! That's my line! I say, Sun as your watch! You should thank me. I'm giving you some extra practice. Come on, guys. You can do better than that, can't you? Looks like I won't be catching up with that carriage anytime soon. How typical of the Schwann Brigade. They can't even manage to capture a single lowlife. Captain Kumor? I say, our apologies for this unsightly display. I'm afraid the Imperial Knights have no use for you, lowborn scum. Uh, please, don't let Sir Schwan know about this, sir. I can't believe our taxes got to paying these guys. There he is. I say, that tops it all. Abandoned by his faithful pooch. <laughs> well, well, you've had a busy day, haven't you, Mr. Yuri Lowell? I'm rather busy myself, but I suppose I can afford to play with you for a while. Gentlemen! It's rats like you that make Flynn's job so difficult. Flynn, little suffering is just what that upstart lieutenant needs. When you've finished with him, throw him in the prison as usual. Ten days or so ought to teach him a lesson. 